Hey everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. In this session, we will be learning about Flash Fill in Excel. Excel Flash Fill is a feature of Microsoft Excel where Excel can sense a pattern in a cell and apply the same logic to extract the similar resultant pattern out of the remaining cells in a table. Might be a little confusing, right? So let us simplify it. So let us imagine that you have a text in one of the cells in the Excel sheet and you wanted to trim a part of that text. For example, let us imagine that there is an assembly, an assembly where the car parts are assembled together to finish a car. So each and every part has a code, the serial number, the product code, and the assembly code, etc. Right? And you wanted to separate all those three. If you wanted to do that, you might want to use the trim function, which might be a little tedious to apply to all the cells. But what if, if I say there is a simple key format using which you can fill all the columns in the Excel sheet within a fraction of a second. Sounds interesting, right? So that's exactly the flash fill function in Excel does. Now, before we get started, let me tell you guys that we have daily updates on multiple technologies. If you are a tech geek in a continuous hunt for latest technological trends, then consider getting subscribed to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss an update from Simply Learn. Now, without further ado, let's get started with the flash fill in Excel. For that, we might want to start the Excel to get in the practical mode. Now, we are on the Microsoft Excel and remember the example we discussed? So, this is a similar example. Now, the first column in the sheet is the product detail. So this product detail consists of the product code that is 112. Next we have the product serial number that is 1002537 and lastly the assembly code that is A, S and X. Now we want to separate this product detail into three columns where we have the first column to be storing the product code, second one to be storing the product serial number and the last one to be storing the assembly code. So now if you want to do that using trim function, you might want to apply the trim function here and trim out the left part. And again for the product serial number, you might want to use the trim function again, which might go into a little complicated pattern. So to avoid the complications and, and decrease the time spent, we might want to use the flash fill in Excel. Now let us help Excel about the pattern that we might want to generate. So the pattern is 112 and the next one is 322. So now you can see that the text was highlighted. That was the intimation from the Excel that it understood the pattern. Now going into the next cell and holding the control key and pressing the E button will help us to fill the remaining cells in the column B. So that's how it is done. And similarly, let's try out for the serial number. For that, the serial number is 1002-5637. Now in the next cell, we have 1003-6582. Now we can go to the third cell and press Ctrl E for Windows and if you're using a Mac operating system, then you have to press Command E and all these serial numbers will be filled. So this will reduce the time in separating the pattern and filling the columns. Now let's try the last column that is A. SX which happens to the assembly code. Next we have F, G and V. Now the shortcut method that is control E and there you go. Now you might be wondering will it work only for numbers etc etc or the text which is properly aligned or separated using a hyphen. No it can also be used for some random text which is like this. So let us imagine that we have a text which is of length like 20 or 30 and you wanted to print only a part of it. So here I'm going to print the alphabets from position 4th to position 8th. So I've already tried the first one that is taking out the alphabets from 4th location to the 8th location or the pattern of the text that is I, F, E, R from Jennifer Lopez. And in the next cell we have the numbers starting from the location 4 to 8 so that is 7767. 7, 7. And similarly, we have the other cells consisting of the names of few cars, that is Alfa Romeo, Bugatti Veyron, and next we have Superman Returns text. So now let's press the shortcut key, that is Control E, and make sure that all the remaining cells are filled. So that's how the flash fill works. So the flash fill in Excel will reduce the time consumed to fill all the columns by separating the text in your main cell, that is the column A which we have here in this example and it also reduces the complexity of using a trim function in Excel. 
Now with that we have come to an end of flash fill in Excel. If you have any doubts or queries regarding any of the topics covered in this session or if you feel that we have missed out on anything important then please feel free to let us know in the comment section below and until next time thank you stay safe and keep learning. Hi there if you like this video subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified click here.